The three points at Lincoln City meant a point was enough at Rochdale. It was a big night up in Lancashire. This is Flickcroft. Early cross in towards Clive Platt. Oh, good save from Lario. Well, the early opportunity for Clive Platt. And again up with the header. with the knockdown, Townsend with the early effort. And again, the Frenchman caught into action. And again, he produces a superb save. This is Duffy. He's found a bit of space. He's got a decent cross in. Well, he's gone for the shot. And I think Larry have got a touch. Rather playing Adams into trouble then. This is Simpson. And the early effort. Oh, what a goal from Paul Simpson. Well, he was on his debut. And will that goal put a dent in Plymouth Argyle's promotion hopes tonight, I wonder? Watton with the free kick, aimed towards Lee Hodges. Got up well for the header. Coughlin is in there. Oh, just over. And that's the closest that Argyle have come. Looking to set Townsend away. Griffiths up with a good header. This is Flickcroft. Townsend away to his left. Trying the shot himself. And Lario having to get down to make the save. Just fancy his chances from here. He's hit it well. Jilk's filling it and it's in there. Marino Keith. And will that be the goal that takes Plymouth Argyle to promotion? Well, it was Paul Watton's initial shot. The goalkeeper spilled it. And Marino Keith was there to turn it home. And Argyle could be going up. corner in, Jilks came for it and it's been turned in at the far post it's Graham Coughlin and surely now Plymouth Argyle are on their way back to Division 2 and so fitting that Graham Coughlin should get that all important goal he's been an Argyle hero all season there's Weatherick then with the corner Aim towards Coffin again. It'll come back for Jason Bent. David Trio not able to keep control. Strong challenge from Bez Weatherit. This is Frio. Oh, the pullback not finding Lee Hodges. It has now. And that is game over. Lee Hodges gets number three, and the celebrations begin in earnest. The final whistle went with a convincing victory in the end. Promotion had been achieved and emotion spilt over. Great celebrations were to be held by fans, directors, management and players. It was a tremendous evening as Plymouth Argyle progressed to Division 2, still with six games to play.
mean, you're the, the one survivor from that uh, that terrible time at Burnley, what, uh, four years ago. I mean, this obviously makes up for that to a certain extent, doesn't it, tonight? Oh, well, it makes up for it. Uh, that was the lowest point in my career. This is the highest point. Things like that at Burnley, then, um, make you a stronger person, make you a better player. You, you've, got to, you've got to experience the lows in football to, you know, take the highs with the lows and the lows with the highs, and this is the highest. Just a complete... I'm completely drained in a complete state of euphoria, absolutely yeah, amazing. What was it like out there tonight? Because you went to goal down and to be honest you've been under the cosh for a fair bit of yeah. the game, hadn't you? And then suddenly you, you were sort of back in it. Straight from the first whistle we struggled, you know, they come at us unbelievable. I mean, of course, uh, three or four corners in the first few minutes. We've been strong all season and we've seen out tough games, you know, we've, we're strong, a lot stronger this year. When that goal went in, you know, unbelievable strike, you can't know anything about that. And, I mean, you could have picked me up off the floor, but Gaffer made two great subs and we've come back in it and we've showed the commitment and character we've shown all year. And you had a part in the first two goals, really? <laughs> yes, yeah, the only thing I did right all game, really. But um, oh, I don't know, just, you know, credit to the lads. Cocker has been on the end of everything all season. Marino, you know, come on, it was different class, but come on. What does it mean to you? I mean, because you're, you're, you know, Plymouth born and bred, you know, through and through, so it must make a, a tremendous difference to you going on like this. Martin, it's just, I can, I'm near, near to tears, mate, when I come off, all the fans there, and, and I'm just so proud, it's unbelievable, so proud to be from, from Plymouth today and captain my local team, just so, so proud, I'm just drained, I'm just drained as the voice is going. And, I just, I really wish my family could have been up in the, you know, my mum, dad and my, my fiancé, Justine, and my brother and sister and that, but I shared with them on Saturday, hopefully. It's not finished yet, though, is it? You want the championship now? No. I mean, we're promoted. That's, that's the first goal. Next goal is a championship, and that's what we want. You know, we want a medal. So. Paul, congratulations. I mean, you, you've got to be delighted to have got promotion now. Delighted for everybody. You're chairman right down. I'm saying the players have been fantastic as well. It's been a long season. We've worked very, very hard uh, to achieve what we've achieved. But was, there's this, another finishing post to be to be got over now, and I'm saying the challenge is there for the players. They appreciate the five ahead, six games to go, and it's up to us now to make sure we win all the games and make sure we get the championship. I mean, tonight it was one of those those games where you had to get a point, but for for a while you were you were up against it, weren't you, really? Well, I've been throwing the balls up lately. Whether we play four five one, whether we play four four two, I do feel. Yeah, the players, the players. I think we've run a race in four or five one. I'm saying, but trying to convince the players is difficult. They they hold on to what they what they have. We, you know, I kind of talked them into playing four four two in the second half, and we've lost a goal early on. And I thought the heads might go down after that. But to be fair to them, you know, they've come out and battled. The three subs that went on done fantastic, and we've got the result we need. 